Again, those comments, Coach Dave O'Shaw. We'll hear more from Coach Shaw this week on local sports. You can hear all his comments this Friday night on the Wayne County Coach Show that airs this Fridays at 6.30. Region standings had BC on top at 2-0, then a log jam at 1-1. Wayne County, New Hampstead, Burke, and Southeast Bullock all at 1-1. The Islands at 0-2. Region games this week, Wayne County at New Hampstead. Southeast Bullock will be at BC, and Burke will play the Islands. Barstow Girls Softball team will host the Super Regionals a week from today at the Barstow Girls Softball Field as four teams will compete for a trip to Columbus in a double elimination event. Wayne County's Game 1 will be next Wednesday at 3 p.m. As soon as we get the full bracket, we'll have that here on our local sportscast. On Tuesday, the girls closed out the regular season with a 10-1 win in just six innings over Glen Academy. The game ended in the bottom of the six on a three-run walk-off home run by senior Dakota Crow. Line scores Wayne County 10 runs on 10 hits. Glen Academy one run on just seven hits. Senior pitcher Addie Tyre gets the win. Morgan Boatwright closed it out. Marley Walling three for four in the game. Candace Thornton with two hits and a double. Ellie Harrison a double and a fantastic play. A shortstop, a diving catch on a hard hit line drive. Wayne wins 10-1 and gets ready for the Super Regional. Again, that takes place a week from today. Again, the first game for Wayne County will be next Wednesday at 3 p.m. Before the game yesterday, the 1998 State Championship Championship softball team was recognized and inducted into the Wayne County Sports Hall of Fame. Team's record that year was 23 and six. In the state event in Columbus, they defeated Paulding High six to one, Pope High nine five, Alexander High fourteen seven, and won the state championship game of Ware County by a score of eleven to ten. Team members included Salisa Bell, Casey Harris, Christina Parson, Leslie Grantham, Jocelyn Griffin, Jenny Tyre, Haley Long, Consuelo Hatcher, Heather Blocker, Ashley Lewis, Lindsey Robinson, Jennifer Hamilton. Tiffany Reynolds, Ashley Bell, Katie White, Jessica Guess, Jody Westbury, and Kelly Brown. Head coach Barbara Struckoff, assistant coach Sharon Daniel, principal Larry Cooper, and AD Rick Thomas on hand yesterday. Also scorekeeper Nicole Lewis in a great ceremony Tuesday before the first pitch. 1998 state championship, championship softball team again, now members of the Wayne County Sports Hall of Fame. Before the Super Regionals begin next Wednesday, the latest softball poll is out. Wayne County comes in ranked number nine before the Super Regionals begin next week. Heritage Catoosa is ranked number one. Central is ranked two. West Lawrence three. North Oconee four. Perry five. Sonoraville six. East Forsyth seventh. North Hall eighth. Wayne County ninth. And Westminster comes in in the top ten. This Saturday, the volleyball team headed to area tournament play, hoping to advance the state. They'll be on the road at New Hampstead. That event begins Saturday at 10 a.m. Also Saturday, the competition cheer teams will be on the road in Vidalia, Georgia. Wayne Christian Academy volleyball team ended its inaugural season at 8-8. Eight and eight. They had two matches yesterday. They defeated the Crossroads Christian Crusaders 2-zip, but lost to the Brunswick Christian Eagles 2-zip. The home games were played this year at the Calvary Baptist Church Gymnasium here in Jessup. Atlanta Braves and the Philadelphia Phillies set for game three today. First pitch around 5:07. pregame before that here on Big Dog Country, FM 105.5. This series tied at 1-1. Again, all the action this afternoon. On WFOFM. Also tonight, Game Three, the LA Dodgers Arizona series. Arizona leads that series two games to none. Tonight in Arizona, that pitch is at 9:07. American League, the Houston Astros took a 2-1 lead over Minnesota, winning 9-1 Tuesday. Game Four today at 2:07. And the Baltimore Orioles, who won over 100 games this year, they were eliminated in three games. The Texas Rangers sweep the Orioles in that American League series. Reminder: the annual JD. Memorial Golf Tournament tees off this Saturday morning at the Pine Forest Country Club. It's a sold-out event. All teams signed up are reminded to be on hand. Tee off time is 8.30. Cost is 2.80 per team. It's a four-person scramble. All proceeds going towards the annual scholarships handed out at the end of the year baseball banquet. Rex scoreboard from last night in 8U football. It was the Ducks 21, Raiders 0. 12U football, it was the Liberty County 8, Jackets 7. 10U soccer, McDonald 3, Johnson 1. Graham and Winalski tied 1-1, one, one, Juan 7, Vasquez 0, Wingate 4, Purcell 1. In 8U soccer, Williams and Jern tied 1-1, one, one, Pease over Graham 6-0, Juan 5, Odom 0, Ward 4, Aldridge 1, Cook 1, Westbury 0. In 12U soccer was Hubbard 2, Harris 0, Reno Cruz 2, Wingate 1. In 14U soccer was Wilkins 1, Banks 0. And that's going to do it for the latest in the local sports.